In 1904, two men got on a train together in Johannesburg, South Africa, and they ended up sitting across from each other for a very long 24-hour train ride to Durban. And as the train left the station, one of the men offered the other one a book to read. In fact, it was a copy of John Ruskin's Unto This Last. And the man began to read the book, and he couldn't put it down. In fact, he read through the night. And by the time they arrived at Durban, he decided that he was going to change his life, that he could no longer live the way he had been living, that what he had read in that book was so profound that he had to change. And that man who read that book was Mahatma Gandhi. It was a book, it was reading a book changed what was a regular person just doing their normal nine to five job, read a book and decided to change their life and go on to become one of the most influential and most highly respected individuals of the 20th century. In fact, Gandhi was nominated for the Nobel Peace Prize five times in 19... 37, 1938, 1939, and again in 1947 and 1948. But just days before the announcement of the 1948 Nobel Prize winner, Gandhi was assassinated. And for some strange reason, the Nobel Prize Committee did not award a Peace Prize that year, saying that there was no person who was alive that was worthy of the prize. Hopefully that will be rectified in the future, but even the Dalai Lama and other Nobel Prize winners have made reference to Gandhi and what an inspiration he was. And it all goes back to that train ride in Joh from Johannesburg, South Africa to Durban, where he read a book that changed his life.